and Hendrick Motorsports started up front. Two in the top six. One lap to go. White flag sponsored by Credit One Bank. You said it, Daryl. He has a way of coming back. <laughs> I don't know how he does it, but they do it every a lot. A double penalty day and a checkered flag for Denny Hamlin. He, Joe Gibbs Racing and Toyota up, win the O'Reilly Auto Parts 500. Work, man, it was fun, huh? 33rd career win and second of the season. I just think a lot of that, Mike, is Chris Capehart. Incredible crew chief. Great leader. I like what he's done with this race team. Two wins after failing to get to victory lane all of 2018. Big wins. And his third win here at Texas. The sixth track on which he's won at least three times. Sunoco is fueling victories all season long. You know what they do now? They got a one up Keselowski. So, no <laughs> tell how long has burnout will last. Yeah, that was a one note symphony from Brad. Well, that slide worked out pretty good. It's been on the show. Uh -huh. For Joe Gibbs Racing, the 161st. Cup Series win. Spread on nine drivers. Their fourth win of the season and eighth here at Texas. Fourth win of the year for Toyota. It has been almost nine years since Denny Hamlin went to victory lane here at Texas Motor Speedway. Climbs from the car. Wants to get that flag. Gabehart just came on the radio and said, we still haven't executed a, a clean race yet, but we have two wins. How did you overcome two penalties today to get the win? Uh, and a Miss Pit Road under green. Uh, just a fast car. He gave me a fast car, a car enough that uh, could really pass anyone in the field. So it just, that means a lot. So uh, it definitely was a, a different type of race, you know, trying to draft and everything and trying to get out of everyone's wake. But proud of this whole FedEx office team here, uh, Toyota, Coca-Cola, uh, the Jordan brand. Uh, Little Big Burger, everyone who helps uh, put this race car on the racetrack. Joe Gibbs, J.D. Gibbs, still thinking about him and his legacy. So, got to say hey, hi to Jordan and the kids at home, and hopefully we, uh, we have some fun tonight.